<laughs> I've never heard that from somebody in my life. Yeah. Engine number five. So this is where they would shovel all the coal into. Yeah. The coal hole, as they call it. <laughs> yeah, I like how that looks like a face. <laughs> Woo! Oh, yeah. <laughs> The wheel is almost as tall as me. Look at those leaf springs. <laughs> Guessing these are like pressurized steam pipes here. I don't know where they would have gone. I want to know how it converts it into the inertia to push it. Is it these pumps you think? These this big is ones? It's, uh, I'm thinking it's these. This this is what would pump back and yeah. forth. I'm not a train guy, so if there are any train fans, maybe compress steam in here, maybe in the valve. Honestly, I don't know how the thing works. <laughs> it's re it's really complicated. It's a complex machine. Whoever invented this thing is a genius. Here's the front of the machine. I wonder if there used to be a cow catcher on the front. There's definitely a light that is probably removed, maybe a brass one. Made it up to the top. This is a behemoth. Jeez. Oh. Hey Max, say hi. <laughs> what up? What are you doing on my train, bro? Uh, this is my train now. I am the captain now. Yeah, this thing has been rotting for decades. Oh, longer than that. Like, like there's nothing resembling. So this is where they'd shovel the coal into. There's some bricks. Old, um, I don't know what the company is. Lipper. Old Lipper bricks. Hmm. Yeah, they had to insulate it somehow, I guess. Oh, I wonder what that is. <laughs> Asbestos. Oh, yeah, the roof's wood, too. So... Oh, look at all the tar. The yeah. tar from the coal. The, yeah, the roof is wood. Look at all this. This is nothing... This doesn't resemble anything on trains today. I've been in like active train cockpits that I wasn't supposed to be in. <laughs> but, <laughs> um, so I can tell you this doesn't, the only thing that looks modern on this thing, like the same is, I think this is the brake. That was unbelievable. The view is all you could see oh, is really? that. And just hope there's nothing in front of you on the tracks. So there is a truck over there. The guy that we talked to on the way in said we were all right to check it out so we might have to explain it to that guy this really is a crazy machine it's incredible to think that over a hundred years ago somebody designed and built this like it's so complex yeah Here's where it would connect to the other cars Huge clamping arm. So apparently this opens. This opens. So this is the big pressurized steam uh, tank, I think. Let's go check out inside of there. Oh. Oh my gosh, was that like a burner? Right there? Looks like a Bunsen burner for a stove. This would hold all the water. Alright, so there wasn't too much here other than this massive ass train. It was super cool though. I'm gonna try and dig up some history on it, see if I can find out, um, maybe search up the number, the location. Yeah guys, if you like what you saw, drop a like, consider subscribing if you do want to see more, and I will see you on the next one. Peace out.